Hi, my name's Jamie and this is my video response to River Cottage Rising Star. Today I'm going to be making a bacon and chorizo pizza, but not with this guy. So let's go in and make it. In this bowl I have flour, salt, yeast and oil. I'm going to add 300 ml of lukewarm water to make the base of the pizza. You have to knead the dough for about three to five minutes just to make sure it's right. And you want to knead it until it just springs back. I've been kneading for about five minutes now and it's at the right consistency that I'd like so I'm just going to put it to one side and let it prove for about half an hour. The piece of dough has now been left for half an hour so as you can see it's doubled in size so I'm now going to assemble the pizza with the dough, basil and tomato sauce, the bacon and chorizo and some cheddar cheese. You can use mozzarella but I couldn't find any in the shop and personally I think cheddar cheese tastes nice so I'm going to do it that way. I'm using a rolling pin because I haven't actually mastered the art of flipping dough yet so this is the next best thing really. of tomato and basil sauce on the top just to spread it over nicely. And for the bacon and chorizo just sprinkle it over. Now as much or as little as you want really but I prefer a lot because I like the taste so that. just sprinkle the cheese over. And then it just needs to go into the oven for about 15 to 20 minutes, depending on what type of oven you have, on about 160 to As you can see this is the final product so all that's left now to do is sit back and enjoy. Personally I think they taste better than shop bought pizzas and most of all you know what's gone into them because you made it from scratch. Thank you for watching my video and I look forward to hearing from you.